Hello everyone, it's Jin Teacher again from Reading Town. Let's take a look at today's article. So today's article, if you look at the pictures, it's a sign of spring, right? Spring is on its way. And this is the Descanso Gardens Cherry Blossom Festival. So we are familiar with cherry blossoms in Korea because it's very popular and we have many people coming from different parts of the country as well as from overseas to take a look at the cherry blossoms. But let's see more about the Descanso Gardens. They have cherry blossoms there as well. So it says, when spring comes, green sprouts shoot up and buds grow. So when spring comes in the time of March, April, uh, it says green sprouts. So green sprouts are when flowers or plants, when they come out of the ground, the sprout means just growth, right? So something starts to come out of the ground and those are green sprouts shoot up and the buds grow. So buds are kind of like these tiny little ball kind of looking things and then they eventually open up and become flowers. So when they come out of the ground, that's a sprout, right? They're growing up. These tiny little plants are growing up. They're sprouting up and the buds grow. So buds are where the flowers are actually inside. The cherry blossom is a leading flower that heralds the arrival of spring and festivals featuring the cherry blossom uh, are being held all over the world, including Japan, Canada and Korea. So when it comes to spring, uh, that's when the cherry blossom heralds, meaning it announces or it's the sign, right? It lets us know when the arrival of spring is coming, right? So it's a herald or it gives us uh, the, the sign that spring is coming. And there's many festivals or celebrations all over the world surrounding the cherry blossoms. And we can see that in Japan, Canada, and right here in Korea. In the United States, Descanso Gardens in Los Angeles County, California, hosted the Cherry Blossom Festival from March 4th to the 5th and 11th to the 12th. So where is uh, the Descanso Gardens? It's in Los Angeles, right? It's a county of Los Angeles in California. And they have uh, this festival in March, right? Two times in March. The venue has the Japanese garden, rose garden, camellia garden, uh, camellia collection, oak forest, and ancient forest. So in this um, venue, venue is that area, right? Or that site. Uh, they have many different types of gardens. They have a garden for uh, Japanese flowers, for rose gardens, another flower known as the camellia, as well as oak forest and ancient forest. So those forests are probably more with the trees, but they also have gardens with flowers. Descanso Gardens Executive Director David R. Brown said, over the last several years, the flowering cherry trees have been stars of the spring show at Descanso Gardens. Adding, last year, the Cherry Blossom Festival weekend was the single busiest of the entire year and we are pleased to be able to extend the festival to two weekends. So we said that weekends are Saturdays and Sundays. So instead of having it just one weekend, they're going to open it now twice. Why are they opening it two times? It's because it's been so popular, right? It's been so popular that during this time, that's when they've been the busiest throughout the entire year. So during the spring, that's when the flowers start to blossom and bloom. And that's when the Cherry Blossom Festival, uh, many people want to come in and take a look at it because it's so beautiful. And because it's so popular, they decided to open it to two weekends. The event offered a great opportunity for visitors to enjoy fantastic scenery made by floral leaves of cherry blossoms against camellias and an oak forest. So because of the cherry blossoms, it looks so beautiful with the background, right? You can see all the other things behind it. That's the scenery. So when you take a picture, you see everything in the background. That's the scenery. So it's very beautiful. You have cherry blossoms with camellia flowers and you have many different tall, strong oak trees in the back. So it looks very peaceful and very beautiful. Due to its popularity, visitors had to make reservations as tickets quickly sold out. So reservations are when you tell them in advance, right? So it's yeyak. So you want to make sure you get your tickets. You want to call or you want to email them and saying, I would like to have tickets uh, next, uh, next week. So you have to do it well in advance. You can't just show up and expect tickets because it's so popular that the tickets have been selling out. So if you want to go and visit, uh, the Descanso Gardens, then you have to reserve or you have to call ahead, right? Many, many weeks before. 
So this is a very popular place that people like to go to bring in spring. That's when people are tired of being uh, stuck in the winter cold and they want to celebrate uh, the coming spring. So cherry blossom is a, is a big sign that spring is on its way. So in Korea right now as well, right? We're about to see a lot of the cherry blossoms happening soon and many people are excited because now the weather is getting warmer. So this is uh, in Los Angeles when in this large garden, this is one of the most popular attractions or the reason why people come. So it says name four countries hosting cherry blossom festivals. Well, we know one of them because that's where we live. We talked about one of them and there's two other countries. Do you remember? It says Japan, Canada, Korea, and the United States. So Japan is also known for their cherry blossoms and Canada even has it, even though they're a colder uh, country. Uh, when did the festival at the Skanzo Gardens take place? So we know that it was two times a month and we know that it was in the month of March. So it's through March 4th and 5th and March 11th and 12th. So they just passed, right? Uh, why did visitors have to make reservations in advance? So they have to call, they have to make sure that they get tickets before they come. And in advance means uh, time before. So why did they have to do way before? And we said tickets quickly sold out. So it was so popular, all the tickets were being sold, right? So if you didn't call, if you didn't uh, let them know in advance before you come, you would not get a ticket. It was that popular. Let's look at the last part, which is the fill in the blanks. It says, blink, spring comes, green sprouts shoot up and buds grow. So we probably need a word that tells us about the time. So it's when spring comes, right? So when spring comes, green sprouts shoot up and buds grow. So I explained that before, when the flowers come out, the plants come out of the ground, that's a sprout and the buds is where the flower is inside. The cherry blossom is a leading flower that heralds the blank of spring. So we said herald is a sign or announcement, right? So the cherry blossom, what does it do? It heralds the arrival of spring. So that means it's giving us a sign that spring is here, right? Or coming. In the United States, the Sconzo Gardens in Los Angeles County, California, hosted the blank festival from March 4th to the 5th and 11th to the 12th. So what is the word that's missing? So we said that in Los Angeles, that's where the Descanso Gardens is, they hosted the what festival? They hosted the Cherry Blossom Festival. So we can see that uh, in the beginning of spring, the flowers start to bud and blossom. Uh, and we see that first with the cherry blossom tree. It's a very beautiful tree. And if you can uh, go outside and take a look at it for yourself, take many pictures because many people all over the world are going to be taking so many pictures because it's so beautiful. So I hope you enjoy the cherry blossom and I hope you enjoy the arrival of spring as well. So until next time, I'll see you again. Goodbye everyone.